Hey, what's up guys? My name is Daniel Lopez with Invest in You Finance and today we are going to talk about how I made $72,598.59 selling on eBay my first year. First of all guys, if you're new to the channel, thank you for watching. Thank you for coming in and chiming in. I appreciate it. Please like, please subscribe, check out my other videos and Today we have a real special video. And that's because it all started back in 2020 when the pandemic was going on, the world was ending, the media was going crazy, and restaurants were closing, businesses were closing, and I was just working at my corporate job. So I was pretty bored and I stumbled upon this guy, this crazy guy, on the internet and he was talking about patience, kindness, all this stuff, but he was a businessman and you guys might know him. His name is Gary Vaynerchuk or people call him Gary V. And he's an, a serial entrepreneur, businessman. And I started listening to what he was saying and people would ask him questions like, hey Gary, like I'm unhappy uh, going to college, what should I do? And he would just say, oh, quit, do your passion. And people would be like, oh, wow, that's like real simple advice. So every question people would ask Gary, they would be like, hey, Gary, how can I make an extra $5,000? He would be uh, simple. Go to uh, Goodwill, go to the thrift store, go buy something and flip it online for a profit. He's like, go on eBay, go to grad sales. Buy some stuff at garage sales, flip it online, flip it on eBay. So Gary was telling all this like practical advice, but people were, were just asking him questions and it, he was just giving like the obvious answer. Like, oh, Gary, I, I hate living with my parents. And he would say, oh, just go uh, move out. Oh, but uh, I can't. Well, then. Think about how you want to get out of there. So he would, he would just tell them like simple advice, but he would give also really good business advice. He had a great, he has a great podcast. And I started listening to what he was saying. And one of the things he said was he gives all of his content and he gives all of his ideas away for free because he says that 99 point, maybe two or 99% are not going to execute on the things he is telling them to do. And that's just why he's not afraid of losing uh, in business or in life because if he just gives away all of his free content and gives away all of his ideas, he's not worried about anyone to compete with. So he's just telling everyone, hey, yeah, go resell on eBay, make a profit, make some money. He's like, I used to do it all the time. I made X amount of money. So I just started thinking like, okay, we're in a pandemic. I'm pretty bored and I want to do something uh, just, to, just to try it out. And I've, I've done eBay in the past, like in college, I would sell my old books on eBay or sell them on Amazon my used college books with the ISBN number. So I thought, I'm just gonna listen to what he's saying and just try it out. Cause that's, that's the ultimate thing. Execute, he said no one's gonna execute and no one's gonna do it. So I'm like, screw it, I'm gonna execute, I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna just see what happens. So I start with an account on eBay and I said, you know what? I'm just going to make this a business. Like I'm not, and I'm gonna go through the process of, you know, registering the business, getting an EIN, getting a business checking account, because like I said, it's the pandemic. I'm bored, I need something to do. Like I'm a person who constantly has to be doing things with projects or working on my car, working on the house. I have to constantly be just working on something. So I said, I'm gonna learn how to register a business. I'm gonna learn how to get an EIN. I'm gonna learn how to get a business checking account. And these are just things that I just decided to do on my own. So I did all that. I created an eBay store 
And I first just started selling basic things that I had around my house. That's what he says. He's like, just look in your garage, look in your room, look for things that you just want to sell to get rid of that you're not using anymore. Because that's just extra money that's laying there that's just, you know, disappearing because you're not using it or evaporating basically. So I started getting things around the house, started listing them on eBay and started getting sales, but sales were, you know, sales were coming in really slow. And I was starting to get discouraged and starting to get like unmotivated. And I read this quote from Alex Hermosi, also another great guy to listen to. Um, and he said, people are not willing to wait 12 years, sorry, people are not willing to wait 12 months to get paid, they would rather quit. That's what the quote translated to. And what the quote means is, a person will not do something for a year, they would rather quit um, on the third month, fourth month, fifth month, sixth month, on whatever month, they would rather quit than continue to try and get it to work because they want that they want that quick cash they want that easy money and you have to work hard or you have to work smart or you have to be persistent when i do something i kind of get obsessed with it so i got obsessed with ebay i started listing more things, like doing different, uh, different um, listings. And ultimately, I mean, I wanted to show you guys my sales so you can see like how my progress progressed. In January, I had $149.27 in sales. And it's exciting to make a sale. It, it feels good when you're getting the money, when you're deposited to your checking account, it feels good because you worked, you created something and you built a business that made $149. It's not that much, but hey, it's a start. And I'm just reinvesting the money and using it to buy more things to sell. February, you know, I made less, $118.60. So at this point, I'm like, oh man, I've been doing this for two months. And I'm not really making that much money. Then March comes, I made $373.54. And I was like, okay, yeah, we're, we're starting to get somewhere. Maybe I just need to have patience. Maybe I just need to, you know, make more listings and just keep trying harder. April comes around, I make $1,702. So now I'm starting to see my hard work from January and February pay off. Because if you're selling on eBay, you, you have to make listings. And that's the thing that takes the longest amount of time because you're taking pictures, you're doing research on the things that you're selling, you're comparing prices and you're making the listings. So that's what takes a long time. So I was making listings January and February every month. And finally, like my sales, started increasing. Bam, we get to May. May. $6,561. June, it dips down just a little bit. $3,026. July, it goes back up. $4,118. August, $5,017. September, September, $23,035.75. That was a ridiculous month. I was super excited. And meanwhile, this whole time, I'm still working for my corporate job and I'm still locked in because the pandemic's going on. So rather than watch Netflix, rather than watch Hulu rather than watch Amazon Prime, I was focusing on building 
my Amazon, <laughs> my eBay business. Man, Amazon just like, it's everywhere. It gets you Amazon Prime, all this stuff. It, it, you know, I just bought something from Amazon. That's probably why I said Amazon. <laughs> anyway, this is eBay. We're talking about eBay, guys. So I was just building my eBay store and reinvesting the money back in the business, buying products, selling them. And I just had an amazing month in September. To get this amount of money, it was just like mind blowing. I was like, wow, like had I quit back in March? Or had I quit back in February or January? Like had I not kept going, kept pursuing, like the, just kept pursuing like the end of the tunnel, like where you're grinding and grinding and grinding, you're not seeing any results. And then finally, like you start seeing the results. So I'm glad I didn't quit and I'm glad I had a patience and I'm glad that I waited and I'm glad that I kept grinding. So then October, it dipped down to $7,648. In November, it went back up a little bit to $9,059. And December, it went to back to another five-digit number, $11,786. So total, guys, total, $72,000. Or five, I forgot what the number written down. Five ninety eight, sorry. Point fifty nine. Seven thousand five hundred ninety eight dollars and fifty nine cents. That's how I made that much money. Through execution, through hard work, through not giving up. The pandemic, you know. I could have been doing nothing, but a lot of people started making a lot of money online during the pandemic. Uh, Twitch streamers, TikTok. A lot of people were consuming TikTok. I wasn't on TikTok. Um, I wouldn't get on it or anything. I was just focused on this. And it, it's just crazy how listening to Gary Vee and all of his free information and advice out there, I was able to accomplish this. And once you accomplish this, you feel good. You feel like, dang, like, I wonder what else I can do. Or I wonder what other businesses I can start. And it was just a journey from getting the EIN with the IRS and you know, registering the business so I learned so much during the pandemic and had I not stumbled upon Gary V on social media, I probably would not be talking to you today about making money on eBay. Fast forward to today. So that was 20, uh, 2020 and then I made in 2021, I made 77K. In 2022, I'm projected to make over $100,000 in 2022 this year. And that's selling on eBay, guys. Like, it's super simple. You download the app on your phone. You take pictures, you make listings, you go find products at the thrift store, you go garage selling, different things like that. And then you just resell them to make a profit. It's, it's like some people say, some of the boring businesses out there are the businesses that make a lot of money. And this would be an example of one of them. All you're doing is selling products to people online. So thank you guys for watching the video. I appreciate it. Please like the smash. Please like the smash button. 
please smash the like button and please subscribe. Appreciate you guys watching. Thanks again. Hopefully I brought you guys some value. Go look up Gary Vee if you haven't heard of him. Uh, Alex Ramosi is also um, someone who's interesting to follow. And I appreciate you guys watching. Peace. And Gary does the five. <laughs>